Welcome to the Burns & Co auction rooms for this, the uh, July auction. As we uh, always do uh, prior to, uh, to our monthly auctions, I'll give you a, a quick 10 to 15 minute walkthrough of the offering here. As, uh, as I already mentioned, this is for the July auction happening on the 11th of July this coming Saturday, starting at 10 a.m. Once again, uh, as I've already mentioned, this is just a quick walkthrough giving people an idea of what we've got for sale. It's not in any particular order. So just please keep that in mind. Catalogues are now online at burnsandco.com.au. Got a good run of uh, good clean household furniture here, solid timber furniture. The tall boys are always popular. Nice uh, size writing desk, TV cabinets, good clean single bed and mattress. Good run of white goods again. That's a, uh, a very neat and tidy Fisher and Parkour fridge freezer. Another of the uh, Bedroom tool boys, floral lounge suite, very clean. Got a really good run of uh, second hand furniture here in this uh, particular sale. More beds, nice big uh, solid timber six seater table and chairs, be a good addition for somebody. Glass top outdoor table and chairs. Another lounge suite, good starter for somebody. Gas barbecue, cane baskets, kitchenware, the odd teddy bear even. Very unusual electric jug there, I haven't seen that pattern before. That one there for you. Telescope, look into the future. There we go, the telescope there, that looks like it's done no work either. There we go there, doll's house. More furniture. I'll just divert over here into the uh, cabinets. Some more timber furniture there for you. The kitchenware, some unusual pieces in here. Okay. Jewelry, lots of jewelry. Bradman albums, haven't seen any of those around for some time. A great man. There we go, more jewelry, clocks and all that sort of thing there. Another cabinet full, lots of good jewelry down there. Might only be costume jewelry, but still pretty popular. Bit of fishing gear. More white goods, coffee tables, cane chairs. This is a deceased estate, this lot. Kitchen cabinet, stalls, chairs, more white goods. Okay, washing machine and clothes dryer. Great range of books. Some nice early books there. And right through the sale. English uh, tea set, or English dinner set actually. Okay, more books. Lovely lamp, nice early one, 1950s, good solid uh, camphor wood chest, nice neat little, uh, little fire guard, quite cute, tapestry. Then we've got the uh, extension dining table, like the dressing table, more books, writing desks. Cluster of tables, nested tables, some vintage uh, Queen Anne style uh, bedsides, a couple of nice clocks, got a bit of age about them too. That one there, the marble clock, it's got the uh, pendulum and the key. Nice early clocks there for you, a bit of tapestry again. More kitchen, then we've got the typical rows of bits and pieces, sundries, crockery, cutlery. More cutlery underneath, barbecue, some um, some cast iron uh, outdoor chair ends, workshop, cut off saws, wardrobes, golf clubs, even a Weber barbecue, cane chair, some good starter furniture there from someone just starting out. More white goods. Need a bit of a wipe down, but they'll come out okay. Books, nice little extension table. Just needs a bit of a freshen up, but uh, it's got plenty of character and it's darn heavy too. Dressing table mirror, early whatnot. Got the mirror on the top, nice piece. Air conditioner, more books. As I said, a good run of books, furniture. And yes, you guessed it, more books. 
big industrial kitchen range hood there. Come out of the Imps Footy Club. Run a household. Okay. Some old tools underneath. Cut off wheels. Tools, nails. It's all here. Around 400 lots this Saturday. 10 a.m. start. Full details, burnsandco.com.au, including catalogues. And as is normal procedure, we're open on Friday afternoon, or Friday from 12 noon to 5 pm for inspections and regos. So please pop on down and, and uh, have a good look around. Very clean and tidy this, uh, this sale. Jacobean, love the Jacobean lounge suites. We get the odd one through here, always popular. That one there is very clean and tidy, as is this fabric lounge suite. It's a five seater. Put the two doubles in a single. Absolutely spotless. Glass top furniture, always popular. Metal base. Selling that that one separate, as is the table, and then these go as a pair. Nice statue. Nice statue. It's got a bit of appeal. So does this big cabinet. There it is there, look at that one. Yeah, nice display cabinet for you. Immaculate uh, table and chairs, extension table and chairs. Then we roll into more workshop. Okay, petrol blower. Looks like a motor off a cool room or something of the like. Toyota, and, Toyota, Toyota tire and rims there. Air compressor. The old electric boiler. Outboard motor. Petrol tanks. Bit of household and shed. Okay, just making my way through here now, just keep uh, keep with me. New light fittings, more books, more workshop. A boat chair, some picket fence to fill in the ones that are missing or broken. Wooden cabinet, winch, even your own worm farm. Okay, car racks, or car ramps I should say, some industrial lights. Making my way through now. Not our biggest sale, but uh, we've got a bit more room to move this time. Big flat screen TV there. Safe, that's a key combination. We've got the key in the combination for that one. Then some nice vintage furniture here. Nice sideboard. Like the display cabinet. Then we've got the table and chairs. Just wait for the light to adjust there a little. Table and chairs extension there. As you can see, it's got the winder. Good clean, uh, queen size bed ensemble. Some newer furniture in from Ikea. Okay, there it is there, running through this for you now. That gas cooktop there, that four burner hasn't been used. Got three boxes of tiles and we've got a big base for a shower. Some cane chairs. Some cane chairs there for you. Electric heater, like the church pew, only a small one. But that's very neat and tidy. Sofa bed's good. This will be uh, this will create some interest. It's a manual one-ton forklift. Okay, very agile. It's come out of Mally Bearings there. They've upgraded to a to a newer one, but uh, works well. Easy to get around on the cement surface. Got a swag, runner beds, new mattress that's never been out of the plastic. There you go there for that one. Another big sideboard. Okay, nice little lead light cabinet here. These timber doors will create some interest. Double set, old white one there. Runner chairs. Just making my way through here. Billiard table lights. Some more vintage furniture. Some records. This is a uh, Wunderlich. Wunderlich pressed tin, either uh, for walls or ceilings. Good selection of that. People now use that to uh, decorate uh, antique and vintage furniture. This has come down from an indie. They pulled down an old house up there. So lots of history in that lot. The old timber um, timber cot. Create a bit of interest, I'm sure. Wardrobes. Then we've got the uh, fireplace around. Okay, just follow me this way. We're not far away from going outside here. Just bear with me. Red sofa or red couch. New gas hot water service, don't think that's ever been used. Okay, take on the main gas. So just bear with me, I'll just uh, give you a bit of a flick around the auction rooms here and then we'll make our way outside. So there we go. 
We've got uh, two, four, six, eight, about ten rows of furniture and household there. Typical range of uh, cabinet lots. And just bear with me. I'll make my way outside and uh, give you a good uh, good look around here. Pot plants to start. As I said, this is not in any particular order. Just sort of as I'm finding it. Very clean and tidy 6x4 trailer. You won't find one neater than that. No reserve either, here to be sold. Okay, there it is there, got the jockey wheel. Nice early wood stove. Box is in very good nick. No holes in that. Water storage, bit of rustic uh, rust. Old bed, disc plates, some old lawnmowers. There we go there for you. Big roller, some early bikes. There's an interesting Malvern Star up here. That one there will create some interest. 1960s. Still got the little uh, the little generator as we all had them on when we were kids. That bike there will create a bit of interest. Okay, we've got uh, Ford motor car, little auto. Little auto there hasn't done a lot of work either. It's a um, it's a uh, Ford Laser. 1995, done 131,000 k's, automatic, wouldn't take much to uh, to get that one on the road, it actually has been registered up and just till recent times, so there we go, not expecting a lot of money for that, we've got the uh, the Coromel van, that's also very clean and tidy there, okay, that one there is a, um, is the uh, 1999 Coromel uh, Signet, Registered there, okay, nice and neat. Got the little, uh, got the sun, uh, the sunshade on the side. So we've got a good run of uh, caravans this style. The Millard, it's the Art Deco. Will become very collectible in the near future. These sort of vans, it's where people are heading with their, uh, with their collecting and their interest into the, um, into the Art Deco era, as you can see. Not too sure how the light will work in here, but this one here's got the it's got the um, bunk beds. Okay. Very art deco. Very clean. Very clean. Been sheltered. Then we've got the track master. This one here is in absolutely exceptional condition. The track master nullabore. Then from Jack and Denise Grover. You will not find one in better condition anywhere. I can assure you of that. On our website at burnsandco.com.au you'll find a full list of that, full list of the features on this particular van. Absolutely spotless. Okay. There it is there. Do your homework on that one before you come down here on, sun, on Saturday and you'll soon realise what a unique opportunity that one is. And then we've got the Windsor Dynasty. In from Robert Garden family there. That's in very good order too, been in the shed with his uh, father's van, hasn't had a lot of work. As you can see, very clean and tidy, here to be sold, as are all the items, obviously. So there you have it, that's a quick walk around for you. More details on our website at burnsandco.com.au. You can give me a call anytime. Ashley Burns on 0408 618 294. Otherwise, we'll see you down here on Saturday, starting at 10 a.m and uh, registrations and viewing Friday from, uh, from 12 to 5. Thanks for your attention.